Hello, it's me, Jackalopium. Welcome along. We're back looking at some more Tale of Immortal. We've got this here. I'm going to call it a ladder match just for being cute. I'm being a bit cute just because it looks like a ladder. Look, this structure looks a bit like a ladder. Uh, and ladders are a, a kind of uh, staple of the fighting game genre so why not let's just call it a fight uh, a, a ladder match why not look at this we're up to 251 stacks there we need to um i mean we could use it and then build up the rest uh, let's try it Yeah, look, there he goes. That is our ultimate. Uh, but I'm guessing that we can hopefully build up a bunch of uh, stacks for ultimates in between now and... And the Mythical Beast. Uh, I don't like running back over that. There we go. That's the next one down. That was pretty easy. Which is nice. We just need to also run off the clock here. Okay, so we've got a choice of two. Either this one or this one. We've got a higher death there. Higher vitality. There's not that much difference in energons. Uh, max focus again I don't really care about so I think I am just gonna go for this one just for a slightly higher death I mean we do need death as well I don't think there's any oh no try not to run backwards Whew. okay and then yeah we've got 87 so maybe we use this every single time we use the Phoenix in every single room Let's try it. See if that will work as a... Uh, just to, to break down the... You know, break the back on this. Quick wins kind of thing using our ultimate. Because I think we'll just get enough bits and pieces. You know, the... Where's the, um, where's the other guy? He's up here. I don't really like going in. Even though I think it was our one created by our... By our Phoenix. There you go. I'm starting to feel a bit better about this as well. Now we are using... I think he, using the Phoenix is probably a good idea. Where is the last monster? There he is. There you go. So then the next one, attack 31. So that's probably going to be the best. Max focus is good. I mean, max energy is good. Max focus is terrible. We could take two points lower attack, two points lower death. A lot lower vitality, um, lower energy, but a higher max focus. That is a really low focus. <sighs> Nuts to it. I just don't see the gains, the focus gains, as, as um, you know... A decent way to a decent reason to offset everything else I just don't see it um, I mean everything you want everything to be as high as possible obviously but I mean focus man it's just focus I mean, it's good for marking people, I guess, and good for recruiting, and maybe we'll look at, into that, like, more 
you know, in the end game, but we're not at the end game yet. I mean, we are moving into the end game. Face tank that like an idiot. There we go. We managed it. Look, massive gains on attack. Defense is okay. Vitality, don't really care about. I mean, we do, but the difference of 400 vitality, if it was the difference 400 of attack, I mean, uh, we're not dealing with that, with 400 attack. We're dealing with double digit attack. But, I mean, it's when you're measuring vitality in the region of 16,000, then 400 is kind of neither here nor there. Max energy is good, uh, and that is, is good. Uh, we do need to max out our energy. So there you go. So yeah, here we go. We are just about to be dealing with... Oh, we've only got two. Let's just eat it. Eat it, man. Let's do it. Let's take... So we've got two Vitality Heals and one... Uh, shall we try? That's why we came here, right? St uh, it's a Skygate Keeper. There you go. Let's um, send this uh, Phoenix out. Ha! She was actually pretty easy. So the mythical creature is actually a lot easier than... <laughs> oh, and she's drained all of our stamina. There you go, Breath of Soul Formation. However, there is a way to uh, regenerate all of our stamina. But we're not there yet. We've got a couple more bits and bobs of admin to do before we before we upgrade. So I'm just going to save everything quickly just in case we mess this up. Or I say we, just in case I mess it up because I am not that smart. I don't know if anyone's noticed, but... <laughs> Um, so there's our five Wajimadoodles. Uh, we're going to be thinking about Blue Monster. Because I've heard good things about Blue Monster. We're then going to stick this Breath of Soul formation in. Zing. Do it. Are we ready now? And then we infuse it. Okay, so yeah, we want to consume this Divine Soul for Soul Formation Breakthrough to increase the following stats. Once consumed, the Divine will disappear. If you choose to keep the Divine Soul, no stats will be increased. So attack 136. Uh, that's what we want. We want the blue monster, man. Give me the blue monster. Oh, perhaps it's um, we choose one. Okay. Do it. Cost. What does that mean? I've no idea. Perhaps they meant. Perhaps when I was reading the guys, they said choose the blue monster. Um. So it's one left over. I mean. We must take added attack. Uh, I think we're going to be leaving Luwu. Perhaps that's the one that people... I do remember the name Luwu coming up as well. So. There we go. And then we keep... 
One sense blip de blob de blue and battle every time you use you'll increase your agility by twenty. So yeah, max focus and agility and that which again is pretty good but it doesn't do it. Are you sure you want to keep Luwu's? The other Divine Souls will disappear and you'll receive Luwu's Divine Soul skill. No. Okay. Okay, so now I know how to do it. We go like this. And then we keep this guy. So we only get one. Are you sure you want to keep Xiaolong's Divine Soul? The other Divine Souls will disappear and you'll receive Xiaolong's Divine Soul skill. Divine Soul skill. Every time you use a special skill, your damage will increase by 4%. Blip -de -blub -de blue And then like all your attacks and crits and all of that. You do want to be... You do want to be quite aggressive so you do want attack to be higher really so let's do it Ugh. blue monster that's how you do it yeah i didn't realize sorry um so okay and this is the first time where so our dragon must be at its max size so we're getting one that isn't uh, the dragon so here we go after dealing damage 200 times in a battle uh, that's our ultimate skill we don't need to worry too much about that for every six percent damage you receive you'll increase your damage Ooh, that could be quite good uh, your success rate rate when performing alchemy is greatly increased yeah i don't care about that max stamina Oh, now that could be pretty good. Mood dropped after learning manuals. Okay. After killing 25 enemies in a battle, your subsequent... Yeah, and another ultimate skill. So it's a choice of either max stamina. Yeah, it's got to be stamina, I'm afraid. Let's do it. That is awesome. After a breakthrough, you have more stamina than before. Yeah, because there is apparently no other way to increase that. And look at all of those stats that came up there. Look at that. Max energy. Uh, a thousand. So yeah, that's gone up to four thousand energy. Spiritual rares. Martial rares. Agility plus 20. Lifespan plus 360. Uh, so we'll have a look at that on our character sheet in a minute. Crit 158. Defense 300. Max focus. See, we got a fairly decent max focus. Max vitality 9,000. So yeah, that has gone up to 30,000 uh, vitality. Skill points plus 100. So I could slot those books now. Crit damage, crit res, crit dr, whatever that is, whatever that is, and attack, that's the main one, we want three, four, five. So at the end of the day, that wasn't much more, even though we concentrated on getting attack as high as possible in every screen there. Interesting. Uh, and then she says something. I believe she's just saying congratulations, of course. Uh, and then this, uh, she said, she's given us a, a new outfit. That's pretty nice. That's okay. So, yeah, I'm going to save that. And then we'll look at our stat sheet to, to fully appreciate it. So, we've almost doubled our lifespan here to 800. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh, stamina. Look at that. 130. Oh, and it didn't, actually. I thought it did re recombobulate your stamina when you broke through. So, yeah, I'm an idiot. So, we need to rest ASAP. Uh, vitality, as we've said before, 30 grand. Energy, 
4,000, focus 2,600, luck 110, insight 107, yeah, attack uh, 1,400, defense 900. Uh, hmm. Where is the crit dru? Affects how much critical... Oh, it's damage. Okay. What? <laughs> oh, it's uh, defensive damage. Like, takes... Like, defensive damage resistance. Okay, that makes sense. And, uh, yep. Uh, and it does mean we can start moving these on as well, which is fantastic. Uh, and then we'll very quickly look at our mind skills. We'll convert. I think that's only going to be one. Yeah, there you go. But one is better than nothing. <clears throat> so I guess we can either go for crit or uh, focus. Again, it's going to be crit. Even though focus will probably have uh, synergy with other skills. Uh, but I'll check that probably off camera. Um, but at least we finished. This is uh, this is everything finished, which means we can start walking over to the next the next um, uh, area, which is Mushion here, and that is what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna very quickly explore this little rump of land here and then we'll just zap over these are all just books i keep in my possession just for i don't know if anyone's going to be asking for those later on uh, i think we use a teleport charm uh, these are only towns right yeah. Let's trans transcombobulate over here. Why not? Uh, and then I think I'm just gonna. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we've got nothing. Because of course we ah let's just grab them both anyway just because we'll end up getting that stuff eventually uh, i'm just gonna um. drop off all of these blasted books um, it does mean that oh actually nuts to it i'm not gonna worry about that i'm just gonna flog them flog them all just because it's going to be a bit quicker. And they're quite crap anyway. They're just greens and blues. Who cares? Uh, but our... Our vault can get really full up if we don't clear out the books regularly. This, uh, even this is kind of a bit janky, so six at a time. Uh, do it. Uh, I would like to pop my new costume on. Yeah, uh, don't I look um, I look a bit more acceptable than the kind of uh, gothy emo black robes? Even though I quite like the black robes, I think they were pretty sweet. Uh, so let's have a look to see if there's anything else to buy. Don't we already have an inventory capacity of a hundred? Hmm. 
I mean, it will up our security, but I don't think that's really worth it. I think we hold on uh, until we get to a city, and then we'll find slightly better rings. And yeah, there's no, there's no mount, unfortunately. Yeah, these elixirs are kind of rubbish. Grab the two pills that we need straight away, just because we've got loads of money, really. Let's have a very quick look in the manual pavilion. Yeah, even in these little kind of like towns and villages. They are not particularly good. Oh yeah, and the other thing I was going to do was Oops. Yeah, look, tree vault is flop. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Yeah, I'm just going to have to take out all of this crud. Wind motion I want to keep. Yeah, wow. <laughs> um, I would like to stick to purple. Uh... Yeah, I mean, mine books, I guess we can just get rid of because we're not, that, they're not going to change over really. But yeah, I would like to make a multi, a multi-discipline build. Because, I mean, we can do it here and now because we have, um, I'm guessing that these fights are not going to be too, uh, what? <laughs> there you go. See, jank, man. Jank. <clears throat> and, yeah, the other thing we are going to do is we are going to... Okay, we don't have enough. It's going to be 200, not 100. Oh, darn it. Darn, darn, darn. Okay, maybe a purple will be fine. And then I just uh, start moving through oranges and uh, reds, etc. Once we get there. Yeah, the Doomsday Whistle is going to go off. I'm going to assign that skill later on. We just run out of time in the month. And you do, I do have to watch out about sticking stuff back in the bank at the end of the month because I don't want to get those books stolen. Okay, so that is the Doomsday Whistle. Uh, so yeah, that is going to be the end of episode 11. I'm going to do some more looking at stuff off camera in between this episode and recording the next one. And uh, yeah... Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. Please do leave a like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.